March Madness should be a national holiday because there are more people that celebrate this than Memorial Day, Fourth of July, Labor Day. You keep Columbus Day. Give me this Thursday, Friday. Absolutely. So you took a sick day. Yeah, I, yeah, I took two. I'll take two of them. I'll take two of them. March Madness tipped off today, and area fanatics flocked to the ultimate sports bar owned by Tom Frerichs best time of the year and I think what makes this thing so unique is um, pretty well attaches itself to male female young old you know you look around here today on a Thursday afternoon and you hear people screaming at one two three four in the afternoon it's uh, it creates a uniqueness to it the first weekend is is, is really big and uh, again I think it's because of uh, you know everyone waits for it and again I, I've owned this 29 years and I've seen more interest year by year and I think it's because there's so many theatrics in this thing now Days, where years ago you used to have to wait for the second weekend to get the better teams up against each other. Now they're all good. The level of competition in the tournament led to a few upsets on day one, which made this fan's day terrible. One fan says even though his bracket is ruined, it's still a great time to spend with friends. I start out so hopeful, and then my entire world comes crashing down because of BS in one game, which is the second game that started out, and then it's all done. But at the end of the day, the excitement of, of college basketball, being able to hang out on a Thursday Friday, kick it with a bunch of good friends, makes it worthwhile. It's more to see an afternoon crowd on a Thursday, full of energy. And that's what I love about the atmosphere here is it's always energetic. You'll hear roars and you're trying to find what TV just had this incredible play occur on. And that part of it has always been the most intriguing part, to just see energy in a bar on a Thursday afternoon from 11 in the morning till 11 at night. It's one of them deals that uh, people love this time of the year and they're going to either find a way to call in sick or take off work to enjoy today and tomorrow and Saturday and Sunday. For WJON, I'm Isaac Schweer.